Hi, this is not a spring chicken. Were you ever curious about how much a baby was worth? Well, in some countries, they can be worth quite a bit. For example, Angelina and Brad, no last name necessary. There are two kids, Knox and Vivian. It's $15 million for baby photos? Can you imagine that? Wow. And, and baby Surrey was three and a half million, I think. Baby Surrey, you for Tom Cruise? That's right. Okay. And then, and uh, then the Matthew's it? baby is worth... Matthew McConaughey. Matthew McConaughey's baby is worth somewhere between, they said, three to seven million. Wow. But that's the new commodity in Hollywood is babies. Babies. Because you know the women, they get pregnant and they pose for Vanity Fair. Because, um, what's the... the um, Jessica Alba. Jessica Alba. She, Cause she posed for Vanity Fair, which hasn't even been seen, and she had her baby. So between that, I think she made more money off of getting pregnant than she has for how many other movies? Yeah, she's never made. Okay, she's never made as much money. They said at least one of the gossip people said she's never made as much money as an actress as she did getting pregnant. Uh, it makes, kind of makes you wonder about the worth of a baby. So maybe the money is going to charity, but. Is it really about babies? Is it really about celebrity? Is it about supply and demand? I mean, does a magazine really sell that much more? No, they, for, they, it doesn't. Basically, or is it's it more bragging rights. Like, uh, what is that Golden Palace Casino that always, you know, play, you know, pledges these ridiculous amounts? For okay, me. it's got to do with okay, the father always. Okay, you you have to be a father and know that fathers have all their children's pictures in their wallet to flip out in an instant to be able to see. The mothers all want their child seen, but the mothers all feel that when they're pregnant, they glow and they're the most beautiful thing on earth, and they all want people to see how beautiful they are. The women that would never see, take I, their clothes I, off do that. See, I don't understand that. Women that don't take their clothes off take their clothes off when they're pregnant and want to see. Yeah. I don't understand that. Maybe it's just me. Maybe it's because I've never been pregnant, or maybe I like many or totally perplexed about that. Well, no, it's a, it, <laughs> you, okay, a pregnant, it's got to do with you never being pregnant because, uh, 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 okay, the, uh, the whole line, uh, most of my relatives are all female, so I, I know what the line is with the, all the husbands will tell the wives, you've never been as beautiful as this because the wife has got a really sharp temper when they're pregnant. The women are oh. all, oh, you're glowing. You know, and make the wife beams. Just you know, to calm them down. just to calm them down. But uh, oh. it's uh, it's strictly well, it a. It could be like a honeymoon glow, like when they're in love. Yeah, but it's got to do with you know also the fact that they have now figured out actors and actresses. Okay, Matthew McConaughey has not had a hit in so long. I know. They don't like a like multi-million dollar that. payday for a baby is a big thing. And you know, they've got a lot of actors and actresses out there right now. Their careers are going down the toilet or basically getting pregnant just so they can get into publications. So do you think we'll be seeing more? I mean, this is not like China where after your first kid, I think you get benefits after your first kid. After your second kid, you get your benefits taken away. Here, they just make all these millions of dollars for first babies, um, pictures of babies, for being pregnant, for all these different things. Now, is that better than getting paid money for um, wearing no underwear and getting out of cars? Well, <laughs> well, it's actually. It, it, or maybe it's the same line. One leads to the other. It, yeah, getting out of one, under, getting out of cars with underwear may lead to the getting the money for. No, I mean that's just. Uh, but baby, the people, you know, I you know I I go along with the people that don't want to have pictures of their children being seen, because they don't want to make their children. Objects. I mean, I know uh, ac actors. Oh, that's right. We're the old guard. They the old want guard to wanted, wanted to protect to their privacy. children. I mean, um, I, I know, I know people, for instance, that basically, you know, they, hey, mom, you know, I, I got a chance to be on, you know, in the L.A. Times this week because I'm a football. I'm in a football team, and they say no because they don't want those pictures of their children out there because they're they're trying to protect their children from the paparazzi. The day, the same, what I'm amazed is the same people that bitch about the paparazzi are the same ones that are selling pictures. Does that go hand in hand? It kind of makes you wonder. I mean, when we were in the, the talent panel on EMA, we were listening to Robert Fuller and, and Peter Brown. Brown. And what they were sitting there talking about the paparazzi getting out of hand. And yes, 
it can very much get out of hand. They can be very intrusive. I've been in a car accident because they backed they into I, you. They thought I was somebody. Because they were they were chasing Britney Spears to be perfectly exact, and and, and the reason I knew they were chasing Britney Spears and had just come from there was they showed me their footage. Yeah, but mm -hmm. it it totaled. No, it totaled the car that you were in. It, it went bye-bye. Well, yeah, so now I have a new car. Yeah. So anyway. But um, but it, it's that. It's just, uh, you know, like, but, you know, it was Robert Fuller that said that, that made the thing about paparazzi. He said that all of these people that are unhappy with the paparazzi will even be more unhappy when no one wants to take their pictures anymore. I mean, they're, they're, we'll put it this way about the picture taking of a, of a, of a woman that you know, has been a big star, that has children that she will not allow her children to be taken pictures of. She sort of got Is upset. That went into an upset meltdown? She went into an upset meltdown because people wouldn't take pictures of her. I mean, and, you know, actually, and she was naked and they wouldn't take pictures of her. So the paparazzi, good, bad, I mean... Well, but everybody does it, okay. Um, but we all like to look at the pictures, don't Okay, we? but Mr. Obama yes. did it with his children. And now he regrets oh, doing it, supposedly. For the New Yorker. That's right. That's not really a paparazzi. No, no, but no, he also did it for Access Hollywood. Oh. Now, there's a couple different things. When we talk about the paparazzi and taking pictures of children, there's one thing when they're respectful and... But there's another thing when they get out of hand, they, ch they chase you, cause accidents, things like that. That's when it gets dangerous. But what it does, it helps all this with the image quotient for all the actors and actresses. Yeah. And it is all that fueling the fire. Yeah, it's just like I said, the, um, the, okay, Brad Pitt and Angela Jolie are getting hundreds of millions of dollars worth of PR for the, the, uh, the countdown on who's going to get to buy our pictures of our children. You know, I mean... Can you it, imagine that? That's right. I mean, okay. Uh, so how long will it be before they have another kid? <laughs> and, and, okay, at, at least, okay, because, I mean, you know, basically... They make quite a bit of money, though. Even though theirs is going to the charity. I don't know which one. Is it yeah, one of their charity? Yeah, going to... They said it's all going to charity, but they get to take it as a, ta a $15 million tax write-off, though, so they make oh, they money. they do? Yep. <gasps> at 15, they're going to... There will be... The money will be given to them, and then it will be donated to charity. So, in effect, it's a net loss for them of fifteen million dollars. Really count as a net loss? It's, it's a it's a, like it's a charitable donation, which basically a fifteen million dollar loss for them. Which, when he's making Pitt is making twenty million, and she's making like ten million, that can be a big deal. Well, someone knows how to work the tax the tax system when it comes to having babies. So, for most of us, oh. Now, the other people that are working the system when it comes to having babies are the people that are making money off of having their babies, not celebrities, but those that are on welfare. Yeah, but that's a, another story. Okay, we can tell it's you a this. Whole other subject. Yeah, we can tell you that uh, <laughs> the system is going to be broke very short. And, you know, that's, why, that's where all of the babies that are being born at the moment out of wedlock. So, but uh, that, that will be another topic another day. But right now, I mean, it is a lucrative business. Actors and actresses having children. You don't necessarily have to be married anymore to have them. Ah, that's true. But I wonder, how big of a celebrity do you have to be for there to be... Nah. Okay, I'm not getting pregnant. Not now, at least. Oh, you heard that one. <laughs> not now. <laughs> so, anyway, for now, how much is a baby worth? Well, this is not a spring chick. We're here yesterday, today, and tomorrow.